The new iPad is out, which means a new Apple versus Android war is probably going to rage. Now, we only had a few minutes with the new iPad at the launch event, but we're going to run through how it looks on first impressions against its biggest competitor, the ASUS Transformer Prime. The Prime is sleek and slim with an 8.3mm profile and weighs 585 grams with brushed aluminium bodywork. It also comes in two colours, a silvery gold and a purpley grey. Apple's new iPad doesn't look too different from the iPad 2. It's got the same brushed aluminium back and black bezel around the screen. Compared to the Prime, it's 1.1mm thicker and 67g heavier at 652g in total. What we've been most excited about to see on the new iPad is the Retina display. Now, although it's the same technology as the screen on the iPhone 4 and 4S, the pixel density isn't quite as high. Coming in with a resolution of 2048 by 1536 at 264 ppi, rather than the 4S's 960 by 640 at 326 ppi, but it's still a step up from the iPad 2. The Prime has a larger 10.1-inch Super IPS screen that's 1280x800 at 184 ppi, so it's also nice to look at but not quite as crisp as the new iPad's Retina. ASUS has a quad-core ARM Cortex-A9 processor on NVIDIA Tegra 3, which keeps the Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich update moving fast and fluidly. Apple have souped up the new iPad with its A5X chip, that packs quad-core graphics that are allegedly four times faster than the Tegra 3. We'll need to test this properly, so we'll hold judgement for now. Apple's put the same EyeSight camera that you get in the 4S into the new iPad, plus enhanced aperture and optics features to get the best out of your pictures. The Transformer Prime has an 8 megapixel camera with LED flash, capable of 1080p video recording, plus there's also a 1.2 megapixel front-facing snapper. Despite more megapixels, the enhanced features should produce better end results from Apple's offering. In our first impressions head-to-head, -head, Apple just about scrapes through as the winner. But when the new iPad's released, we'll get it in, along with a Transformer Prime, for a full head-to-head -head review. So keep checking back on techradar.com.